Some breaking news you might not believe out of Japan. Minutes ago, Japan's national broadcaster, NHK, sent a false text alert reporting North Korea had launched yet another missile. CNN's Paula Hancock's live force in Seoul. Paula, what do we know? Well, Dave, you really couldn't make this up. This uh, has come just within the last hour, just before 7 o'clock. Uh, the national broadcaster in Japan, NHK, sent out uh, a text alert uh, which said, uh, North Korea likely to have launched missile. The government J-alert evacuate inside the building or underground. Now, this J-alert has been activated uh, in recent months as North Korea has fired uh, ballistic missiles over the top of Japan. So certainly people react to these messages in Japan. But then uh, very quickly afterwards, they corrected themselves, saying the news alert sent earlier about North Korean missile was a mistake. No government J alert was issued. So coming just a few days after there was a similar uh, incident in Hawaii, an alert sen sent out saying that a ballistic missile was on its way uh, to, the, uh, to that area and uh, people should seek cover. Uh, it is really quite surprising, but of course that did take uh, 38 minutes to correct. NHK uh, far quicker uh, in, in being able to correct its mistake. In fact, in their, their main 7 o'clock bulletin, uh, the, the main broadcaster had to, uh, had to say, I made a mistake, this is not what happened. Uh, but, of course, it will make people in Japan jumpy. As I say, this has happened before. There have been J alerts, and it has not been a mistake. There have been uh, North Korean missiles either uh, heading towards Japan or going over the top of Japan. So, two in just a few days, it's, it's really quite remarkable.